Former Cal star and Oakland native Ivan Rabb was presented with the G League Sportsmanship Award earlier this week. But as Vern Glenn reports, helping others is nothing new for Rabb and his family. Dennis, I'm in East Oakland, corner of Havens Court and Bancroft to be exact, where something is cooking here. And that's not a good thing. That is a great thing. Number 25. Ivan Rabb here, Oakland native, Cal Bears second round pick of the Memphis Grizzlies at age 23, keeps paving his NBA journey. Now with the New York Knicks G League team in Westchester County. But this isn't really a basketball story. If you spotted tomorrow at the HOR, could, could, could he have a chance at horse? Oh, a horse? <laughs> what do you think? You spotted an HOR. <laughs> no, I would lose. Nope. <laughs> His brother, Tamarik, 14 months younger, is an academic star at the Haas School of Business at UC Berkeley. Any given day, both are drawn into Devon's Cajun Kitchen in East Oakland, run by the most valuable member of the Rab family, Mother Tammy. My boys definitely, um, they definitely keep me going and striving, trying to do better, and, and um, just love my family. You see, this is a family story. The baller, the businessman, the boss, and collectively what this culinary spot means to this community. Water crab, water noodles, and ten shrimp. We call it the sparkle special. You gonna eat all of that? Oh yeah. <laughs> Customers love it. Well, on this day, Tammy and her staff were preparing 600 meals for World Central Kitchen for school lunches. They do 1,400 a week. And during these pandemic times, three times a week, Devon's gives away free meals. It's not about like what people see, but it's more of like her instinct to give back to people in general is just, it's, it's just amazing. We kind of were raised up um, around that, in, in that type of atmosphere. Like we just kind of give and don't count the cost. And um, like, I feel like that's something to be proud of. To me, it's not a challenge. It's just something that's just, it's stuck in nature. Like if you're hungry, you're not gonna go without. As a child, Tammy always had a passion for cooking. And when she brought those skills to Oakland years ago in a move from Oregon, it wasn't long before her talent drew notice at First African Methodist Episcopal Church. Pastor Mayberry let me use his kitchen, and I did my catering out of there. And in exchange, I, did the, uh, I fed the homeless for three days a week. And so that kind of just evolved. Three years ago, it was a partnership with Chef Zoe at a place called Tasty Pleasures. A year and a half ago, Tammy took over the location and renamed it Devon's after her first son who passed away. It was then Ivan who handed out a huge assist. I didn't really have enough revenue to do it and just until my money came in, and so he helped me with that. So I would just say, hey mom, how much you need? Yeah, yeah. When the pandemic hit, Mom drew from her son's strength. I don't know if I, I don't know, maybe I should close the doors. And they're like, no, mom, just, just keep going, keep going. I, I, it was like three really slow days. I was like, oh my God, nobody's coming. And then all of a sudden, everybody just started ordering. It, 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 it was fine. Appetite for giving, indeed. Tammy Rabb stands tall. First of all, Ivan is six foot 10. Tamaric, six foot six. But Tammy, six three. In Oakland for game day, I'm Vern Glenn. Uh, thank you, Vern. Great story. Uh, coming up next, the NFL drops the hammer on the Patriots again for spine. And after being on the market for three months, former MVP Cam Newton finally has a new home.